Okay, we're going to register to bid for the auction that is Wednesday. And we're going to go to the home page of HendersonAuctions.com. We're going to click on if you want the auction details, you go here. You can bid with proxy bid through Weeks Auction. Uh, you can bid with Equipment Facts or you can bid with our site through Bid Wrangler right here. If you go um, just to preview catalog, it brings you directly into our catalog. You're going to register to bid for this auction. If you've registered with us before, you only have to get basically approved for this auction. Go to register to bid, type in your information. If you've already done it, if you forgot your password or it says it doesn't remember your password, this is where you would reset your password on this forgot your password site. We're going, if you haven't ever signed up, you would need to fill out this information here and go through the registration process. So I'm going to verify that all my information is correct. This is the bot, the terms of the sale that you are agreeing to. You're going to put in your credit card information. Then it's going to any kind of message that goes out for anybody who's registered is going to pop up in here. This is your information and this is where you can see your registration information, uh, any kind of account information would be in here if you needed to update anything. Um, but to go back to the screen, um, we would just hit the back button here. This is what the screen should pop up. If you want to, during the live auction, hit the active button, you would do that. And only things that are selling at that time are going to pop up in order. If not, if you do all, then everything that is in the sale is going to pop up. If you need to search for something, let's say a Wanko um, light plant, you would just type it in here and everything that is um, Wanko is going to pop up or if you just wanted a specific lot number you would type in the lot number here and that would come up. Um, if you need to clear that screen and go back to the other screen just hit the word clear and then it brings you and this is showing as of right now the um, the lot order of the items. Um, the sale is a little differently normally our items are in numerical order this one will be out of order as it goes down the line but that is how it will sell however it is showing on the screen as of right now they have this selling first this is second this is third so on and so forth over here if you want to look at this all the auction terms to look over those loadout dates things like that um, and if you are bidding on items, you can see your items in here. You can see your max bids, your closed bids, your active bids, so on and so forth that you've been bidding on. If for some reason you hit the back key and you go back here, this is our other sale that is the 16th. But if you go in here, this is view auction again. Again, if you wanted to put in a pre-bid, um, you could do that now. You just hit pre-bid, put in whatever amount that you would like, and then um, hit place max bid. And that is going to not just automatically bump you up to your max bid. It just, as people are bidding, it will bump you up, whatever the increment is, $5 or whatever, until it reaches that goal if people are bidding. If it doesn't reach that max bid, uh, then it doesn't automatically um, go to your max bid. Um, if you needed to print anything, you could do it here. Or if you needed to share anything with anybody via email or on social media, you could do it here. To log out, all you do is go here and sign out.